Hi, in this video I'm going to take apart this Creature Combat Attack Net. It's a remote controlled um, a quadruped robot with like a nerf gun attached to it. I'm mainly interested to see uh, how the legs move. Uh, just to give you guys an idea how big this toy is, uh, I'll just put a mark here. Um, the head comes off easily enough. It's attached to the rest of the body with, uh, with just a simple electrical contact, I think, for the lights. Um, same thing with the Nerf gun. Uh, I think it's a really elegant design that the uh, remote control seems to be uh, sending signals to the Nerf gun separately from the body. Um, and also this bit, which is the uh, elevation for the gun. Very simple uh, device. Uh, let's speed up this bit. I'm going to try to take off the legs first. Uh, it appears to be uh, six uh, screws. Let's speed up this bit as well. I was a little bit surprised to uh, find this. There's a little secret message for people who take this thing apart. It says, uh, never give up. Uh, there's a circlip keeping all the legs together. I'm going to just use a screwdriver to try to pry it out. The first three legs uh, comes off together, they're all attached as uh, one single assembly. The next three legs are individual legs. Um, it's uh, quite interesting that there's this arm that kind of controls uh, the whole movement of the legs. Uh, yeah, you can see how that works. Uh, so with the legs off, let's have a look at the, how this thing works. So if you if you press on the forward and backwards uh, button of the remote control, you get uh, these gears moving and, and it's controlling this uh, arm that moves up and down and uh, a little bit to the side. Uh, if, you, if you press the uh, left and right button, you see this rotation going on which actually rotates all six of the legs. Let's take apart this bit as well as to see how it looks like on the inside. Uh, I'm going to speed this up. Hmm, why isn't it opening up? Uh, okay, there's this uh, small more screw here. That's the screw for uh, the battery compartment. Um, this thing is run by uh, four AA size batteries. Okay, now that we've got this open, let's see what's inside. It seems to be a fairly simple circuit board that's uh, controlling two motors. Uh, one is um, controlling that uh, up and down motion that is moving the legs, and the other is controlling the rotation motion that is uh, turning the head of the robot. So there you have it. It's a very simple um, device, you know, two motors controlling six legs. But I think the execution uh, is uh, not so straightforward. 
Uh, I think they must have take, uh, done a quite a bit of uh, experimenting to get this to work. I really like uh, this toy. I think uh, opening it up uh, explains why they can meet uh, a really competitive price point. Um, yeah, it's a really fun little toy. Uh, why don't you guys uh, check it out? So thanks, thanks for watching this video.